What's up everybody, back at it again. Fish at Middle Tennessee, we're gonna paint some more bait here. Um, today, we're gonna do some of these flash-sided jerk baits here. I think it's a three and a quarter inch or something. We're gonna do a simple shad pattern. So all I'm gonna do, opaque white top, opaque white the belly, leave the side so we can get that flash. And then I'll come back with the maybe a little yellowy green on the top side here. And then darken the top up just a little bit and give us a little um, shad dot on the side. So we'll see how it goes. Fish it. Fish it. Fish it. It. All right, first things first, opaque white, all on the top. Leaving that flash side there. We're gonna hit the belly. So that's all I'm doing. Top side, leaving the flash, hitting the belly, and then I'm gonna go back. Hit that with some pearl over the top of that. I got the opaque white on there, so now we're gonna hit it with the pearl. I changed my camera because last time I almost knocked the camera over like three times. So we'll see how this video turns out like that. All right, there's the pearl white. We'll hit it with a hair dryer, set it with heat, and then we will <clears throat> come back with some, I'm gonna figure out some kind of yellowy, goldish, greenish something for the top. So I've got this pearlized copper here. I like this color. I'm hoping this isn't the one that's chunky. I've got one that's chunky, but I think that's wicked gold. So we're gonna try to hit this <clears throat> just on the top a little bit. Give it a little bit of gold flash. Or should I say copper? All right, so I'm just gonna try to run it down the back here. I don't want to go too far down the shoulder. Yeah, that's why I thought this one's a little thick. <clears throat> Put a little reducer in it. They get thick like they don't want to come out. They're thick. All right, let's try now. That one actually turned out pretty good. 
that this one and that one suck. Let me hit it with a hair dryer and see if I can clean it up. Put a little more down the sides than I wanted to on these, but that's the only way I'm gonna be able to fix these. Hit that one a little more on this side. clean this out see it's a little more than I wanted on the sides there but this one is the way I want it like that still got the flash but got a little on top these a little too much but they're gonna have to work so instead of using black on the top of these I'm gonna go with a dark brown transparent See how it works out here. Just gonna lightly go. Little stripe right down the back. I think I'm going to do a dot on the side. I think it's going to look good like that. I may... I think I may do the fins there. Hit those with a little brown. I got to cut out a little template for them though. Let me try that real quick. So I cut out a stencil. We're gonna lay it over the top of there. And just darken up that fin a little bit. My thumb's probably in y'all's way. But, let's see, let's do it like this. There we go. We don't want that. There we go. Perfect. Looks good. Now let me hit the other ones on the other side. See if you can see that. I like it. All right, I'm gonna take some of this brown while I have it in here and darken up the front of the nose and the eye a little bit. Just like that. Nothing crazy. Cover most of that up with an eyeball, but
All right, now we're moving on to the eyeballs. We've decided to use gold. Bear, I see you. All right, so just like all the other ones, a little dab of super glue. Stick it on there. Try not to stick your fingers to it. <laughs> yeah, I think that gold looks good on there. All right, let me stick all the rest of these and then they'll be ready for clear. All right, time to dip it. <laughs> 